Hello everybody, welcome to my third SFL game up against Tom Schniz, the bread mask himself, Plim Plum Pluserweight, JFW Superstar. He's got a Mighty Blow Dancer, Strip Tackle Dancer, Guard Catcher, Block Catcher, Wrestle Dodge, Wrestle Block. So, you know, not that good, a, not that scary a team for most teams, but for, for Lizard Men it's horrifying because of the Strip Tackle. Um, yeah, it's pretty bad. He's going to molest Skinks at will. Um, I've got a skink with sidestep and three SPP on a crux ago since the original creation of the team. Replaced the Saurus that uh, Skuro killed. Speaking of which, here is Skuro. Hello. Hello. Jim needed to up uh, up the amount of SFL titles uh, involved in this game from one to now four by bringing in the three-time SFL winner, the winner three the winner five, the winner eight. It's me, Skaramezzo, and I am excited to call this one and hopefully watch Tom Schniz absolutely massacre Jim's team because Jim and I are in the same division. Yeah. Um, third completed, hopefully, Connor. I've completed two this season, haven't completed any until this season. Hello, um, Samich. Um, yeah, so this is the third game of the season, and I did complete the first two. He's choosing to kick, so he'll have the one turn chance. BLGF and GG. <laughs> oh, this is uh, what what one thing that hasn't been talked about a lot in the uh, epic lead up to this game. That had a lot of strategic conversations about um, what both sides are thinking. Is we are looking at two masters of the early GG here, uh, and that should come into play in a game like this. Uh, Jim, Jim, of course, famously has dropped several great GGs in competitive CCL play, but Tom Schniz uh, really kind of, kind of, kind of invented the early GG. Some would say uh, in the early days of the SFL and CCL, really, really, really strong uh, early GG game, and that could come into play in this one with that tackle uh, strip war dancer uh, loping around. Yep. <laughs> this is great, isn't it? I get to be my JFW. Uh... Yep. Oh God, what happened? What happened? Third. third uh... Oh, I don't know. I, I forget why I said that. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yes, third third SFL game of the season, court night, fourth overall. <laughs> I've joined twice, but never finished a game the other two seasons. All right. um, no, 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 Elp. I'm. Uh, I, if you if you're just getting in here, I'm rooting for Tom in this one. Uh, Tom is is NA, just like Jim and I are all clearly from uh, North America. But uh, Tom is in a different division, so I have to play Jim one more time, and I only played Tom once uh, this season. So I'm rooting for uh, rooting for Jim to get a bit beat up here and maybe lose a game. Thanks, Guru. Jim, of course, is on top of his division right now, having uh, had the benefit of not having to play Fault Force yet. So he's uh, one. What he's one, one and zero oh right now, and looking to add to that with this game. Whereas I'm uh, oh one and zero oh right now, and uh, waiting on Fault Force and Trend to potentially play or get admin. <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> yep. Well, that's, this is the glory of the SFL. No complaints from me. I respect the uh, the gamesmanship and the uh, scheduling game, a very important part of SFL action, uh, and uh, trend trend showcasing some early skills uh, in that department. And of course, Fall Force is uh, a legendary scheduler, uh, probably his best quality. And Jim <laughs> instantly burning that reroll up. Yeah, I knew I shouldn't have blitzed with my but it was just easier to hold formation. Yeah, he played one game and then quit, I think, Cornite. It might have been one and a half or two. <laughs> and the failed pickup right off the bat and uh, going about as uh, well as you'd expect. Yeah, I've, I've, I've joined. This is the third, my third time in SFL, Cornite. The first time I joined, I was hating third. Blood Bowl and I was losing to Wolfbark and conceded and quit. Uh, with chaffs and the second time i had necromantic and i don't know what was happening in that game but i i was again i was hating blood bowl 
Um, so I conceded and quit. And then the oh, third so you time, never actually completed a full game? No, no, not until this season. So there you go. <laughs> oh, wow, this, I popped your cherry. Yeah. <laughs> and then this season, I was enjoying Blood Bowl. So I thought, I'll join the SFL now that I'm enjoying it, seeing as it never worked out join, joining it when I hated it, Blood Bowl. And it's worked out better. Tom going for the kill the, the skink strategy did not pay off for him there. Glorious. I thought for sure if he hit a Saurus this uh, this turn, it would die. <laughs> <laughs> wow, but he's uh, putting the backfield pressure on, and can you really blame him? No. Double one? Oh, nope. Look at dog. Close, though. Will he make the Ooh, other dodge here? No, he doesn't. Dog. Question is, is he going to leap through with the ward answers and basically give you... Give you his uh, defensive half of the field if he can't, if you can get the ball up there. Oh god, this is horrible, isn't it? Because I've got to make the pick up this turn. Yeah, you, yeah, you might have had to make the pick up last turn. Yeah, that's why I didn't want to blitz with a <laughs> tackle. <you know>? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Well, folks, we might see an early first half. First half of the first half early GG in this one. We'll see how this uh, plays out. No, Tom not going to go whole hog here. He's going to maybe bank on another one and nine. Not the worst play. Yeah, if I fail to pick up here, it's uh, sometimes. I do think I would have tried a three plus two plus with that loner at the end of the turn, though. I know it's a little bit of a risk, but every elf you got on his feet. Mm. Here we go. Getting dangerously close to Jim's uh, SFL career here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty bad. I mean, I, there's no point even getting in the way here. I don't think. Mm. Kind of a pick your poison, because if you try and screen off those elves in, in your backfield, you're going to get bogged down by the elves in front of you. Yeah. Just got to make the one and nine. That's all you got to do. And he's good. We've got a ball game, folks. Good. Something tells me we're just going to see a... Uh, Two chipped skinks and uh, and a retreat by the elves here. Maybe just one chipped skink. Oh, I'll leave my Saurus alone. <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> oh, he's going high pressure. <coughs> oh, is this one of those situations where I'm like... I might as well just be watching your stream here. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. No, I'm a little bit ahead. Punch my soul. Oh, he got him. He's fine. What totally fine. Man. What a big Now, man. what does he do with that war dancer? I think that war dancer isn't going to get safe. <laughs> He's got blood, though, hasn't he? That makes him essentially safe anyway. L'Union fait la force, comme on dit. One D a skink. No, no, two D a skink. Yes, yes. Allez les gars, tous ensemble. No problem though. Well done, skink. Oh, well, if Jim wanted to, there's a there's a pretty good Crocs hit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or you could just yeah, you know, or just the Saurus. But either way, I think I think the most dangerous player on the field is getting hit right now. <laughs> I mean, I'd sure like to, yeah. Oh, 
joueurs viennent au soutien de leurs coéquipiers. Not going after the tackler though, huh? Mm. Tackle script. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to ping pong the other one around a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, I could have hit him, I guess. St yeah. Still worth trying the mighty blow on the other one, I guess, too. Didn't work out, but. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, maybe this should have hit the tackle. Mm -hmm. I don't know if now we see how rowdy Tom wants to be, he could go for that uh, that one D, the one D with the tackle strip. Probably a bit too rowdy though, in that it ends him next to a Crocs. Yeah, and I do have the sidestep to control the bounce a little bit. Yep. Although neither of those spots that you could sidestep to are particularly exceptional. No, but <laughs> there's better. elves everywhere right now. It's better than nothing, though. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah. yeah, unfortunately, well, my, my tackler just yeah. getting hit every turn sucks. Yeah, it does. He's getting oh, hurt all the way back. Sake. Oh my goodness! Oh my god. All right, no. not horrible. G -G. MNG'd. Oh, there it is. Type it. You got to type it for mm. it to count. G -G. Well, let's take a look at the old schedule for Jim. Who is happy about that miss next game? Well, it's Fall Force. You'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never have to play that game anyway. <laughs> So it's kind of like you've got a it's kind of like you got a bye week for that MNG Saurus. <laughs> yeah, some bad bad death luck with the Sauri though. Yeah, yeah, two Saurus, excuse me. Yeah, two dead in three games. One I didn't apple, but obviously that one I had to with it being an yeah. attack. Yeah, yeah, the one game. I killed was a rookie, so yeah. whatever. Yeah. Still fucks me for the game. I mean, this really fucks me for the game. Yeah, yeah, he can really tee off on you now. Out bashed by Wood Elves. You hate to see it. Mm. I'm getting a little bit penned in there by the Elves. Yep. <laughs> but all it takes is one armor break on elves and the game can uh, swing right back. Mm. <laughs> and then <end> turn. <laughs> <laughs> This full on Death Star, I'm Jim. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm trying. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> oh, man. You do have both more guard and more strength than him, so you can't just, like, you can't just base up a Death Star, you know, and uh, make you suffer. Oh man, I can't believe my apple is already gone. I'm already played down, and it's my best player for this match. Yeah, oh. but at least you're playing against Wood Elves. They're not likely to kill that many more. I, I said not. that with a uh, straight face. Yeah, I guess. So. <laughs> Still 12 mighty blow hits to come. One of the things that infuriates me more than anything else about Tom Schniz. <laughs> Is that mask in his name on his uh, coach name is not capitalized, the M. Oh. So Lebred is, but mask is not. Yeah. What an annoying piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, oh, absolute asshole. <laughs> <laughs>
The biggest scumbag I've ever seen in my life. Mm. Just killed the skinks. Skink survives. Unbelievable. Game must be bugged. <laughs> he's looking to get everyone in front of you now, and uh, now that he's got a little bit of uh, a little bit of a, a bash advantage here, he can just try and slow you down, prevent the score more so than worrying about uh, a steal and score because he's not he's not leaping into that. <laughs> yeah. Exactly, Lemon, yep. <laughs> Not just that, a comedy mega dicing as well. Tackle mate, he <laughs> killed. Well he's got the right uh he's got the right uh team icon for it. Yeah he does, yeah. Nice hitting for extra blocks here. Croc's gonna get some action and definitely not gonna bonehead. Yeah. Oh, and gets the pow. You got the cars. Oh, baby, does that level him? No, no, he's still one away. He got a touchdown oh, yeah. in the first game. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Fucking touchdown. Second game, wasn't it? Was yeah, second, second game. game yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I wouldn't allow a cross <laughs> touchdown. Get the fuck out of here. Who killed him, too? Glorious. He's thinking that no, he does not apo it. And uh, J5 is going to be the beneficiary of any uh, any uh, kills or MNGs in this one. Uh, J5's chaos. Uh, I think he said he was struggling a little bit with them early on. Mm -hmm. I'll scream so. like a scene. <laughs> yeah, if they, well, now, now the numbers are even. You can probably base them up a little bit more. Try and force another uh, failed dodge or uh, something, but but again, yeah. that one war dancer basically changes the game. Yeah, it's, <laughs> well, he's just it's, stood back there safely. <laughs> yeah, it's horrifying. It's absolutely horrifying. I think he's just gonna kill the skinks, Jim. Mm. Better three die this skink though. play here it is is he gonna just one d yeah no but he can uh he can leap in for it uh, for the 2d oh, on the ball so he's, no he's oh, using the gun to hit him yep. and then and then yep. hit him as well but yep. didn't get the power He'd assisted from directly below, he could have pushed him away and got the assisting for 2D in the next one. Yep, yep. So, slight mistake by Libre Mask. Ha ha ha. Oui, oui, oui. Grand Blue. Is he? Blonde no, I thought, for some reason, I thought he had one more guarder on this team. Mm. Guess not, he only has the one. It's, it's so much guard to see, but none of it's his. <laughs> <laughs> Just the one catcher. Mm. I almost think, and you'll probably hate this, but I almost think if he has that strip tackle, uh, and maybe this would only be good in this matchup, but with that strip strip tackle dancer, if that other war dancer had uh, had guard instead of uh, mighty blow. Oof! No, I hate that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll definitely give him mighty blow. You, you two leap, two, two leaps in would be asking a bit much, I guess. Yeah, and you can just give him, you can just give him my, my, like, you know, you can just give him tackle later, so I think it's yeah. worth taking the night blow tackle. 
And then there he goes. His guard, his guard catcher in some trouble now. Mm. That turn did not work out for him. Watch him right in. <laughs> in yeah, gotta, gotta push down here, haven't I? Oh, oh, it's turn seven, Jesus. Yeah. The riot fuck me a little bit. And this is this is one of those turns where you just what what you don't want to do, Jim, is scurrow it, right? <laughs> you want to remember you want to remember the speed of your entire team, not just the ball carrier. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking skink tato. <laughs> probably a little bit better when most of your team is move six as yes. opposed to move four <laughs> yeah that's the sick thing about this it's really big, um, it's very difficult for them to uh, to do that sort of thing Well, it's looking like this is probably going to be a score here, unless Tom does something Ooh, pretty bad him. shit. <laughs> killed him. Well, that that was the uh, that was the penalty. Good. And there's the Apo into an MNG. Uh, so uh, yeah, no guard, no guard for Tom against uh, Chaos next game. Die, elf, die. Well, I should make a team called. Should make. Do you know what I think? What I'm going to do is next next season, which is like tomorrow, a chaff team called Die, elf, die, and then a wood elf team called The Elf, The. <laughs> <laughs> the old Simpsons reference. Yeah. <laughs> Glorious. It's pretty good. Yeah, I don't think Tom can reasonably try and hit this ball here. I think he's just got to maybe screen and hope for the best. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully he can't. I mean, if he leaps in there and hits the ball on reds, there's no other way around it. Yeah. Uh, I guess he could get a 1D on it if he really wanted to, but then he'd get surfed. Yeah, he's got to put work in to get the 1D, and then I get the sidestep to the, like, yeah. in the middle of the ball. Nah, there's, no hitting, there's no hitting the ball here. I hope not. No one who plays it, what else could be an evil man? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, pretty good. I'm going to do Chaufs and Woodies next season. Fuck it. Oh, baby. That sounds like a recipe for two weeks of CCL and then two months off of Blood Bowl. Yeah, maybe, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What are the odds that uh, the CCL season starts on time tomorrow with the the beta launching? Oh, I think it will, because it's just up to Gary and the lads, isn't it? So I think that'll be... Uh, yeah, I guess that's true. Well, unless the server goes down. Oh, he is going for this. <laughs> yeah, true. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. He is not fucking around, folks. Going straight in for the reds. <laughs> <laughs> Here comes the reroll hey. into a skull. But he hangs on, and Jim has scored. Well, not yet. Can we surf him? <laughs> that would be impressive. Surfing the down player from... Uh... Can you do it? I think you can. No. Yeah, I think, I think uh, maybe. If you blitz him up there, go there, mm. and there. Yeah, I think you can. Oh, I see it. So push him there. I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say it, but I there. do. I do see the play, guys. So uh, I think we can make this a 3D. Oh, you should have played, um, guys. Tom is desperately <laughs> chatting right now to save himself. I can't read <laughs> what gonna be said, amazing, though. guys. <laughs> well, did not surf him. <laughs> Didn't surf. But that was a fine, a fine hit anyway. Wasn't yep. It? Now the question: How many, how many unblock or blockless uh, hits do you want to take here? Yeah, I want to make this one. Yeah. 
I can't 3D the uh the This one lets you 2D lets you 2D the mighty blow dancer with block though. That yeah. Might be yeah, that's all I can do. I wanted to be able to 3D the dancer too. Hmm. Right, go on, rookie. Get some SPPs. Oh boy. <laughs> Got him. Hey, wild kills. Half Donker might be the best uh, Skirmetso clone <laughs> on this team. Yeah, that's certainly something. <laughs> All this because Saturn failed us. <laughs> <laughs> And there it is, one nothing. The lizards are on top, but one turn to come. Probably a reasonable chance at it, though he does he is down a catcher right now. And a lot of strength for to have to push around. Yeah. Hopefully this is good enough. <laughs> um, sorry, Skuro, all this because Sata failed to start the spin for fuck's sake. Reported! <laughs> that was after the uh, <laughs> the toxicity, I guess, of the show button. But that's two great removals. I mean, obviously he got the best removal, like the tackle mighty. But I guess that's made me stop me making blockless blitzes, so it's not that bad for me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but it's really nice having a mighty blow tackle to hit dancers with, isn't it? And he's leveled this Mighty Blow guy now. So that, that, I really did like starting a dance with Mighty Blow for sure. Because then you can just you can just level him really quickly to have a Mighty Blow tackle account. Yeah. This is an interesting, interesting game so far. Because if you look at it from Tom's point of view, he was kind of cruising. And then he, he did try to set up that double hit. And it he just paid the ultimate price for it. It didn't work out for him. He lost his garter and he got scored on all. A hole in one go now. You probably would have scored on him anyway because it wasn't... I think that was the turn he needed to really retreat back to get in your way if he was going to have a reasonable chance to stop you. Yeah. But with Skinks, I mean, you could always kind of get through. Yeah, that's the great thing. You don't need much penetration to uh, to have a scoring threat to you. So even though I left it super late, I was just yeah. able to get in there and still quite protected. So. And, and if there's one thing I know, it's uh, it, it's how to get your way without having to do much penetration. So. <laughs> yes. The bear is the minimum. Call it a day. Good to go. It's really bad that it's like I mean it's 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 both hilarious and great, but it's also bad because it's the definitely the best term for for like you know getting through oh, yeah. the opponent, isn't it? And it's only a problem because we're all super immature. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah that's true. Super immature. Well, this looks like it's going to be very challenging for him. Hmm. Hopefully he fails. Le <laughs> Pimpon Blue. I honestly don't even see how he's doing it currently. Probably. Other than, I guess, a ton of reds. Yeah, red there, and then red there, and then... Yeah. It's tough, isn't it? It's tough. <laughs> it's tricky. Looks like he's maybe thinking about not doing it. No, 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 he was, he was doing that. Oh, so I see, I see, yeah, he's doing, doing this part first. Yeah. All right. Yeah, if he can get some luck on the reds, he's got the reroll. Yeah, and he only needs two pushes. Yeah. It's the kind of movement nine, aren't they? Oh, imagine if he da his dancer dies trying this. That would be nice. Sure would be. For you. <laughs> yeah. But here. So it's a one. -er. Yeah, that was just to make it a one, -er, wasn't it? Oh, I see, I see. Oh, he's doing it this no, way. Dancer. Oh, that's so much smarter. <laughs> yeah, that's so much smarter than what I was thinking. <laughs> My way was terrible. <laughs> and he gets a tour, but he hasn't filled in the squares. Did he hit with this guy? 
He hasn't filled the squares in. Oh, I thought he was... Yeah, that's weird. Yeah. Oh, maybe um, he's... He had to leap and, or something. Yeah. Oops, did not use the right guy anyway. Yeah, because this guy was 3, 4, oh, 5, yeah, 6. So he'd have been... Yep. He'd be minus 2 with the other guy. Oh, no, would he 3, 4, 5, 6, 7? He'd have been 1D. He'd have been 1D with that guy. And then it would have been a 1 or a 2 with the last guy. So, yeah, it wasn't that hard. Luckily, he hit with the wrong fella. So now we see uh, see what Tom wants to do here. Um, what do we got here? Tom is down players now. He is. So I guess a little bit depends on his opening hits, but chances are he probably plays you to the draw here. I hope so. <laughs> Early season lose. SFL, draw's perfectly good. I don't, I don't know, know what his is. record is this season thus far, actually. Let me take a look at that. What are we at here? Tom is currently... What the fuck? Satterfield's winning his division right now? <laughs> oh, he's just played more games. <laughs> yeah, a draw, put, a, a draw puts puts Tom level with Satterfield at the top of his division, whereas a loss puts him... A stat keeps him where he is. So he could actually play for the win here. But I don't think he's going to against Lizards and Jim. <laughs> mm. Seems like maybe not the game to try and do that in. I hope not. <laughs> um, hello, one hawk. No, no, among us too. I'm pretty tired. Maybe pretty I'm tired. Me. You sound like you're basically asleep. Yeah, I'm basically asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Just dacker and draw. It doesn't look like he's dackering. Oh no, it does. Don't know why I said Dacking, I don't know if I like the DACA against liz well played lizards though. Mm, no, he's not dacking. He's straight and just killing another Saurus probably. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why dacker when you can just maul Saurus every turn? Yep. <laughs> just the push. Mighty blow tackler, my kingdom for a mighty blow tackler. <laughs> hey. Do you know what I hate, right? When somebody dodges away from tail and somebody else tackles them. Does my head in. Yeah. <laughs> you literally failed because of the tail and Randosaurus tackles him. It also happens with people that have tackle too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That also pains me. I think we're gonna see a bit of a Herp Derpingtons here. Oh yeah, hell yeah. So now we are. Uh... <clears throat> Entering into a very uh, important phase of the game called how many two pluses can Tom Schniz roll? <laughs> this is a bit too rowdy, I think, putting him there, but I don't care. <laughs> Against Wood Elves, my biggest fear on plays like this is that I end up accidentally pressuring them to score and then they get a blitz on me. Yeah. <laughs> when they were very clearly going to just draw. <laughs> yeah. you know? I've definitely had that happen. Like, this, is a, this is a bit rowdy, but obviously like having the scoring threat there is pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. In, case, in case something goes. Oh, yeah. Case something yeah, it happens. makes them think. I mean, again, all it takes is a, is, <laughs> is a snake. Mm. People roll snakes occasionally. They do. About one in 36 times? No, thereabouts. Depending on who you ask uh, how the how biased the dice are. Yeah. 
Not even dead. Glorious. Yeah, there goes that scoring threat for a turn, though. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was a very, very, very optimistic scoring oh, threat. Obviously. <laughs> very optimistic. But now the thing is, if he re kind of retreats into that pocket and, and protects the ball, he just gets swarmed. Mm. Looks like he knows that and is thinking about a different plan here. Is he going to just go back with the ball here? We might we might see a forced DACA here. Mm. Although he probably wouldn't mind hitting that Saurus. Just <laughs> Not easy for him. You just gonna dare the one D from the skink? <laughs> oh, he's rolled a one. He's rolled snakes. Oh my oh, god. Oh, he snaked. Oh my god! If only I had that scoring threat. <laughs> <laughs> How ridiculous is that? I mean, you've got a scoring threat. His name is uh, Tony. Yeah, yeah, that's a good <laughs> point actually. That is a good point. <laughs> All he's got to do is power blodger. Yeah. Very good point. Let's punch him first. And also punch him. It's good having block, isn't it, to be honest? It's a pretty good skill block, you know. Pretty I don't know good, if you yeah. knew that. I don't know if you knew that, Skuro. <laughs> Pro tip. Yeah, I'm... Uh... I was uh, pretty pretty well aware of it uh, in that I, I, I did just play you down block <laughs> <laughs> and strength. Yeah. Actually, I might have had the same amount of block as you. What do you got, four? Yeah, not too many. Yeah, four. yeah I, had, I had four as well. Actually, I might have even had five, but one of them was the ball carrier. Going a bit safe. Safe moves first, and then we just go yep. for the score. <laughs> yeah, I think you can. Uh, I think you can find me on this. Uh, if you can get him down. Doesn't get him down. Oh, he goes for the reroll. Gets the pow. Oh, Where's this and the going? Oh my God! It's a disaster for Tom. Go on. Go on. Go on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> didn't, even, didn't even style on him at the end there. Oh my goodness. Well, shit. Four. I don't realize. Four. Tom uh, really has no one to blame but himself for not scheduling this on a Friday night. It's <laughs> a good point. Wow. The scoring threat worked fantastically. Imagine thinking Lizards had a bad matchup. <laughs> what an asshole. What an absolute asshole. Glorious. Wow. Dice to hell and back. <laughs> well, that was pretty good, wasn't it? Pretty good. <laughs> Glorious. No, I no won't give five, in two, two. until oh, yeah. I'm victorious. I think, uh, I think, uh, I I think Tom defend. has a, uh, a worthy complaint defend. to the ad. To, to Gary uh, in, in, in that I called that play at the start of the turn for you. I really <laughs> coached you into seeing that Saurus. You did, un yeah. <laughs> un Unabated to the yeah. ball carrier. <laughs> <laughs> Just the easy that? five plus suggestion and uh, score. Yeah, that was it. That was it. You, you, you know, you, you visualize and I actualize. That's what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Marty Boy, for staying fantastic for four glorious months. And oh, a yeah. perfect D. Oh. Tom is. Uh, remember when you called this a comedy mega dicing? I think you were correct, Jim. Yeah, maybe, maybe it's looking, it's looking more and more <laughs> comedy mega as we, uh, as we continue. Uh, I think there are, well, Jim called an early GG in the first half, but I don't know if he typed it or not. I did, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, the early GG was uh, incredibly well deployed. Maybe almost like, maybe it was too safe calling it that early, <laughs> but it, but it's all, it's been all Jim since that GG. <laughs> yeah, glorious. <laughs> so, yeah, once again, mastery of the early GG. Tom really has no one to blame but himself. <laughs>
I don't know why I didn't put the other skink there instead of in the middle. It was like, that's the weak point, no, never mind. Can't believe you rolled a double one. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, people, people roll them 100% of the time, uh, according to this game. 100% of the time, 36% of the time. Mm. Or, you know what I mean. 1 in yeah. 36. I know what Whatever. I mean. All right, now now we're seeing the, oh. the, despera the, the desperation potato here. Oh. Oh. Oh, well, there goes the skink. Another wouldn't double one, be, please. <laughs> would, wouldn't this be a fun two-two draw to watch? Yeah, there's a danger of that, but at least at least not going to lose. Yeah, no, almost certainly. Yeah. I was very aware that he might come back and make it two-two, but. <laughs> <laughs> Still got to do some work to get there, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this isn't too terrible. Leap time. Oh, Fails yeah. the leap. He's got to put the reroll in here. Nope. Snake the uh, dodge again? Nope. All right, well. Still, uh, still think you've got a hit on the ball here. Yep, still got 2D on the ball. It's a soft 2D, but, you know, it's not mm. nothing. Yeah. Okay, not if he makes this. <laughs> okay, good. Ooh, what about the Crocs here? Oh, he's, he's pissed. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen you a high roll before, Jim. Yeah, yeah. Hey, it's it's not even a bad idea. I think I'd uh, stick with the original 2D plan. <laughs> Besides, if you get sidestep on the ball, it's a, it's a guaranteed win. Is that how it works? Yeah, didn't you know? Don't you know anything about this game, Jim? <laughs> I'm sorry, no. <laughs> I'm a beginner. Alright, let's power. Do I re-roll? I'm not going to re-roll. Because I have to survive. You know. After this. <laughs> Now, now I might consider that Crocs dodge once everything else is done here. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm, I'm totally doing it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Everything else based up. I guess yeah. There's no real reason to follow because you're screening them all out. Yeah. Um, I guess I don't really roll this. this is a bad one to fail, but I don't really roll. Good. Wouldn't this be a hell of a dodge to make? And double GFI. <laughs> I mean, he just leaps anyway, right? Oh, are you going to put him on the ball? I was going to just put him on that mighty blower. Oh, yeah, the double GFI is so much better, though. Yeah. Diced. Diced. Ah, you wasted the six on the bonehead. Yeah. If this had been tabletop, you could have uh, accidentally forgotten the bonehead. <laughs> I could have yeah, done. Yeah. Would would have been good to go. Mm. Oh wow. Oh wow, he full powered you. How <laughs> dare him. Outrageous. Ooh, double one, double one, double one. No way. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh he rolled another one! No way! Oh, no. oh. Uh, would he have been better doing the 3-2 be with dodge, then? I guess I mean, it wouldn't have worked out with it for the dice, but... Yeah, this was more likely to work, but that was more likely to work without using a reroll. Yeah. But at the end of the day, you don't want to not score, do you? So you've, you've got to do yeah, this but, that way. And he still has a reroll to try and turn you over. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> now it's a bit tougher. Mm -hmm. uh, down a skink. But...
Not terrible. This is the classic Wood Elf Blitz coming up here. Yes, yeah, this is... It's really the only thing you have to have on your mind in this game right now. Yeah. Well, I'm desperately protecting the ball every turn, like, to the best of my ability. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, true. It's, it's always tough. <laughs> well, that might uh, might hurt your chance to farm passes, Jim. Yeah, what a disaster! Because <laughs> I know you were thinking about doing that. This game. <laughs> Pretty much got this one locked up. Farm a few passes, get a level. Yeah, easy. Oh, that source who scored—he probably he probably needs a pass, right? Yeah, that would that'd mean it would work, wouldn't it? <laughs> Well, this is a much more exciting second half of the game than we thought we were getting, so there's yeah. that. Yeah. Nice. Even if the result is still playing for a draw. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A lot more fun to come back and 2-2 uh, two -two it than 1-1 uh, it. Yeah, for sure. All right, Tom's got to roll some dice, folks. The good thing is that if you, you can't go totally ham to get the ball, because then I could break away and score a third, right? So that, that's quite good. Maybe I could have even sent a skink forward as a scoring threat, just so that you'd have to worry about that as well. You can do that next turn, I guess. He is. Red. Oh, well, there goes that reroll, but he does get it. Ball's going to be loose here. Uh, what do you mean by progression, so? Um, yeah. It's like so, like they level up and everything, but they just they start with you start with a. It's yeah, it's not res. You start with a custom team with some skills, and then they still they still skill up after that. We have kind of a home brewed redrafting system, as it were, between seasons. Yeah. This is the best way I would describe it. Yeah. Well, that ball is only a four plus away from being stolen. It is, yeah. But there are no rerolls left, so. Yep. He's going for it, though. I I, I gotta believe. Oh yeah. At least I like went the other side of where he was. Like going to there would have been better. Size definitely he would be better, but then that was the side his dancer was on, so I didn't really want him. Yeah. And so I assume he tries to snag it with the wrestler, dodge out, and hand off to the uh, the dancer. Yeah. But he's not in scoring range. He's got it. Oop. He's got it. Oh, I, I do like putting the Rackler back as a, as a safety, though. Gets the pow. Can 
Could have pushed him in for another block anyway. Didn't need it. Ball right into the hands of Asaurus, and oh, well, that's about as good a scatter as you could ask for. Mm. The very best, Saul, so the very best. In fact, you're watching, uh, you're watching a one-time champion now, uh, Le Bread Mask, trying to uh, outcompete some uh, some pretty rubbish uh, dice in the first half. I think it was uh, not not a. I would not say this has been a comedy mega dice thing though, but uh, some things swung the wrong way for Tom. That's for damn sure. Yeah, yeah. It's been close to a close yeah, to a it, comedy it's, mega. It started off pretty scary for you, yeah. <laughs> but with that 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 rectified quickly. Yeah, with this match, Jim, you will uh, you will play as many full games of SFL as I've won championships. <laughs> yes. Well, I hope you all like watching uh, Ward Answers Leap every turn, because uh, <laughs> pretty pretty sure that's the rest of this game all lined up. Yeah. Well, survived one turn. He, yeah, no, he doesn't have an easy, uh, does not have an easy two plus here. No. No, he's got a little dice. Could technically do it. Yeah. If he wanted to red for a push, he could, he could maybe try and cancel the, uh, the Crocs. But that seems a bit shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maybe just take the one D, <laughs> the one D with wrestle strip or er, uh, strip tackle. Yeah. It actually really bums me out that he built that dancer strip tackle, not tackle strip, because that's how I want to say it. Tackle strip. <laughs> but then I look at it and I say strip tackle, and it sounds weird. Yeah. Oh, bastard. Oh, boy. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> no rerolls, oh, by the way. Dear. And this is not the sidestepper. No. There's a pretty obvious direction here to push <laughs> this ball. Go on, catch it. Catch it. No. No. Catch no. it. Oh, God. One uh, tackle zone. Oh, boy. One tackle zone. Still, though. No rerolls. There's, there's always a chance of no rerolls. Does he want to just make a bunch of threes now? I think he's just got to pick it up and retreat here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he definitely just picks it up with him. And runs. Oh, man, he's really really uh, laying into that dodge. If only he had <laughs> yeah. tackled. Yeah, he's rolled a million ones. <laughs> <sighs> Not on the pickup though. Ooh, oh, he's got dodge. Oh, he's rolled a double one. Hey! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. And uh, I think uh, I think the uh, skinks aren't gonna have too much trouble getting right back to that ball. But how to protect it is the problem, isn't it? That is the problem. But it's getting it's getting to a point where it's gonna be hard for him to get that ball and score. Not impossible yet, but he only has two turns to do it in. Nice chain gives you the block right up to the uh, to be on the ball. Yeah, I'm not not sure how good it is. I want to hit this guy. It's good if you knock that elf down. Less good if you don't. Yeah. Uh oh. Le fair play, c'est sur fait. <laughs> Dear. This was not the turn for all pushes, Jim. <laughs> no, it wasn't, was it? <laughs> really gotta take that wrestler down, too. Yeah. Oh, for 
fuck's sake. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. But you do have the ball in hand and you've got it on the right player. Yeah. As right as the player can be. Yeah. And you did get the wrestler down. Yep. Oh, that armor break is actually huge. That makes it harder for him to 2D. Yep. Uh, not, not that much harder, though. <laughs> no, no, he leaps, he leaps to there, doesn't he? Yeah, he's just got to cancel the Saurus. So though. I can't, can't do a whole lot. But now, now we're in that world of his score threats are, are limited here. Yeah. Really could use him failing a leap. Yep. Yeah, the leap, the leaps are the pickups is what I was expecting him to fail, not the not the two plus with the reroll. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's been kind of the other way around, hasn't it? Yeah. Well, this is it though. This is pretty much the ball game for Tom here. Yeah. Oh, he doesn't go for the cancel. He's just going for the one D, and he's just banking on the strip, which he gets. Uh, here, don't that's, I yeah, I was about to say, that's pretty much the only square. Where's that ball going to end up, though? Oh, he doesn't, yeah. Oh, Way. nice. Oh, pretty good. Nice. I think now he's got to leap and five me. Five me, Blazer. And now there might be the breakaway this turn if he, if he fails. You might even have to think about no. No, oh, yeah, just get the score and threat. Yeah. 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 It's not a bad shot at all. Yeah. Yeah, that would have been great. Yeah, if the skin could just call it back. He's got to keep those other two Saurus tied up. So he probably doesn't want to move those loners. Or does he bring one around? Yeah, he does. Ooh, interesting. Hmm. Well, he's got two score threats. Yeah. But all you got to do is get the hand, the skink, get the ball in the hands of a skink and run. Pretty much counted. Yes. That should not be that hard. Yep. Oh, interesting. Okay. Yeah, I'm not I sure. Thought you, I'm I, doing this I right. thought you were gonna chain the war dancer off. Yeah, I was. I was gonna, and then. But that involved the Crocs, I guess. Yeah, yeah. I don't have to use the Crocs. <laughs> oh, all the pals coming up now. <laughs> uh, Tom, you've been playing just fine. It, it's been a tough game for you. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you've done anything wrong. Yeah. Yes. There we go. Okay, he's got it in hand, and that's pretty much GG. Right, two GFIs to get away from the dancer. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't think he can get that ball now. <laughs> that should be good. 
Yeah, you know, in looking at your success in the second half, putting the pressure on Tom, you're probably right. But Jim was pretty protective of the ball in the first half. Yeah, yeah, I was a lot more protective of the ball in the first half because I had 11 men, didn't I? Well, no, I didn't actually. I went down to 10 pretty quickly. No. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but, you know, it felt like I had more players in the first time. At least you killed the Saurus. It's, it's MNG'd, but at least you killed it. Yeah. Apparently that is the toll for Jim to uh, to, to play against a uh, SFL champion this season. He has to have Asaurus straight up die early in the game. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I like a massive cage for the whole first half, didn't I? Yeah, it was. It was, yeah. it was almost full death started at one point. Yeah, I was aware of just how absolutely terrifying the uh, the dancer is. <laughs> Let's see if you can kill two. So, uh, yeah, here you go, Tom. Uh, the three-time SFL champ, Skirmezzo, killed one, Soros. Can you kill two? <laughs> he should have GFI last time. Please don't kill him. Please don't kill this one either. <laughs> yeah, this is the worst one to die. Yeah. Ah, you should have followed, so you could have uh, you could have fouled him too, Tom. What are you no coaching. <laughs> both of both of those dancers, carry on. Both of those dancers could have foul could have followed, and you could have had a you could have had a way better foul than this. Come on, Tom. come on, come on. Okay, good. Uh, Jim really benefiting from both uh, both games against uh, coaches who have progressively gotten higher as the game went on, apparently. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my goodness. Good luck. Soyez la tour ballon, soyez taille le bouton avec les supporters. Sûrement les deux à la fois. Un joueur adverse dans leur but. Mm, I could punch somebody out and care about punching <laughs> the, the old bubble box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't see how this fails, to be honest. Yeah, it's guaranteed. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> and count it, folks. It is a dicing. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> Power Crocs. You love to see it. <laughs> Already asked for an admin review. <laughs> Wowie! Amazing. We'll see how well that Crocs rolls. That uh, that doesn't bode well for uh, my division, though. Glorious. Yeah, uh, uh, the one thing I really enjoyed in our first game is the advantage of having two really good mummies with yeah. with you having nothing that could really compete with them. Yeah, yeah, it was, they, they are nightmares, those two. Yeah. Yeah. They're pretty much the majority of my team, to be fair. <laughs> yep. It's just God, isn't it? Just God. All right. Not the end of the world. Yeah, it's pretty good. Next regard is good. Um... And yeah, touch, a touchdown for Tony as well. There was, there was a touchdown for Ansi and for Tony in that game. Glorious. <laughs> um, so now hopefully Tony can get another touchdown in you know in the next one. <laughs> I know that's greedy, but still, like he's a touchdown away from a level, isn't he? He's a touchdown away from a level, and the others are uh, have got some SPPs as well. So yeah, not bad, not bad. A little bit Tony, but the problem is how many L's there are, right? Because there was there was Wood L's and Dark L's, both very tough matches, but um, both. Uh, <laughs> so that's why I deliberately took the mighty blow tackler that I wouldn't, I wasn't going to take. I was going to just take five block guard and thought, oh my god, I'll crush this. And then I looked at then I looked at the schedule and I was like, oh my god, every there's a million there's a million L's, so I just need a mighty blow tackler to uh, have a chance against all of the L's. Um, so, yeah, Tony, you say that like you think uh, Jim was trying to play on hard mode. <laughs> Why yeah. would he ever do that to himself? Yeah, yeah I like easy mode. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I was going for. <laughs> but yeah, the, the the amount of L's does make it dodgy. But but even then, right? Even even like obviously the worst matchup is like what else? But even that isn't that bad because at least you have loads of strength that you can beat them up with. You know, like it's a bit worse in this situation because they've got the strip and the tackle on the same guy. But like you know, if it's tabletop. They've, yeah. they've got one strip and one tackle, so they can't do everything with one guy, so you can play around it a little bit. 
Mm. Yeah. Well, at least mm. you're not going to really miss out that tackle against uh, Fault Force in six to eight weeks when you get to play him. Yes, yeah, that's great, isn't it? Yeah, that's great that that's not going to be a miss against him. Yeah, the, missing a Saurus is obviously bad, but um, but yeah, yeah. not actually going to miss the tackle on him, so that's nice. Uh, right, so there you go. Thank you, thank you, Skuro, for. Uh, for, Absolutely, for always happy to uh, to uh, promote the SFL action, the greatest <laughs> league in Blood Bowl Two and all of professional Blood Bowl. Glorious, <laughs> and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>